What's up guys, if you want cheap, fast, reliable AMT, make sure to hit up my sponsor and use code BUGS for 5% off checkout. Links down below in the description. Hit them up right now. What's good YouTube? It's your boy Bugs back on another NBA 2K21 My Team video and guys today we are going over the market before we get into the video let's hit that like button let's hit 50 likes we're doing more empty giveaways every single day guys uh, if you guys didn't notice we did a uh, 100 300,000 empty giveaway yesterday we are buying and selling MT on Instagram and Twitter if you do need MT make sure to hit me up to build your god squad and uh, if you need any grinding services hit me up we're gonna get right into this video man we got a lot to talk about in the market should you guys sell your cars today how are you gonna make MT right now we're gonna go over everything so all right let's get into the video man um lately i've been honestly been getting destroyed by the auction house glitch man i have missed so many snipes so many snipes because of this glitch man it's been really tough but i'm gonna tell you guys if you should sell your cards right now so let's just get into it man let's check out michael cooper's price and honestly i invested in a couple not gonna lie i say he rises up to 20k why do i say this well if you compare him to Mono Ginobili, guys, he's really, honestly, kind of close. Better on defense, too. So, yeah, that's the reason why. I really do think Michael Cooper is a top player in this game right now, especially for his value. Um, he has Hall of Fame clamps, guys. If you badge this guy out, he is going to be a complete manimal. So, right now, was is it worth the, worth the investment? Honestly, yeah, I think he goes up to 20k. Um, it's kind of risky, but in my opinion, it seems somewhat safe. I actually invested in about three so far for around 8k. I say his price definitely goes up to at least 16k, so you can make at least 2k per profit. But uh, right now, should you guys sell your cards? Is it a good time to sell? Well, we're gonna get into that right now. So looking at Dominique Wilkins, guys, he went up so much MT, and he was 130k yesterday. He's up to 207,000 MT. I was trying to get him, I did not succeed. So, here's what you're gonna do. You're gonna try to get Dominique on a snipe. This is the filter right now I'm trying to use. I missed so many Dominique, so many Roy's, so many Manus on his filter, but I also got a ton of Manus. I don't have one, not two, but three Manus. I invested in Curry, and this is exactly how I'm gonna make my MT right here. All these investments, and then I'll show you the squad. I invested in Roy, got him for 90K on Xbox. Giannis sniped out for 100K, it only took me 10 tries. Um, but I finally did get the GOAT for 100k. Mono Ginobili, I got them all for 95k and less. Deron Williams missed one for 25, ended up getting for only 95. He's not, he's actually kind of cheap right now. His price will probably continuously go down because there is a lot of point guards in the game. Invested in John Stockton, guys. John Stockton's price. Should you guys sell him yet? Well, let's look at his value. To be honest with you, easiest way on bid cards, if you want to make your max amount of MT. Well, here's the plan. So you want to wait till around 9 to 11 Eastern time, okay? Uh, make it make it 10 to 1 a.m. Eastern time. Um, try to sell your cards at that time. So if you're Pacific, it would be 7 to 10 Pacific time at night time. You want to sell these cards, you want to put them up for 12 hours, and you want to put them up for bid. That's only with bid cards. For a buyout, you could put them up for a little bit more and just hope they sell. Uh, but that's pretty much how you're going to make your most MT off bid cards. That's what I've been doing for a while now on 2K. So definitely try it out. Let me know how that does work out for you. Um, so let's just keep going over pricing. So realistically, guys, Deron Williams, I saw last time I checked, is now buyout in which indeed I believe he is. So let's see what he's going for. Yeah, Deron Williams is a buyout. So if you guys do have him, if you want to take a risk, I mean, it's kind of risky. He's probably going to draw down in value. Even though this card is one of the best point guards in the game. He's insane. His handles are beautiful. He does have a little less badges than John Stockton. But I don't know why, but I like this card a lot more than John Stockton. Don't ask me why. I just think he's a complete animal. He plays really good for me. Uh, I believe he has silver range extender or bronze. No, he doesn't even have range extender. But believe me, this card's a beast. He has silver clamps. You could up that up to a, a, a gold clamps. This card's a beast. I think his price does go down in value. Another card, guys, if you want to sell Giannis, now is a good time to do so. He is so good, though. Like, if you're grinding solos and you have Giannis, bro, keep Giannis. He is insane. And honestly, I'm thinking about sliding on a diamond shoe or some gold shoes on him because, yo, this card is the real deal, man. If you throw this diamond shoe on him, 
This shoe is not expensive at all. He will become an absolute animal. He will go up to like an, uh, an 80 mid-range about and an, a 92 speed. A 92 speed with that size is almost unbeatable. And if you haven't played with him yet, he has been absolutely incredible. This Giannis right here is so good. He makes such a difference to the squad. So if you want, I would definitely pick him up. Try sniping him out, man. I miss so many Giannis's. I don't know if you guys were on the filter. <gasps> Oh, right there. See, that's the auction house glitch. That's why I get mad. If I would have got that Giannis, I would have made around 50,000 MT in one second. As you guys can see, he's 170. So if you guys want, definitely try sitting on this filter. People put up their 100K Giannis's. And not only that, why do I know this? Well, think about it. If the auction house glitch is still here, people are going to go on the Giannis filter, see this one's up for 100K. What are they going to do? They're going to throw them up for 100,000 MT as well. So right now, one of the best snipe filters in the game is Giannis, guys. You're going to make 50 KMT per Giannis you get. Definitely try it out. For the lower tier dudes, the guys who want to invest, the guys who want to make other methods of MC, well, we're going to check out Eric Gordon's price. Peep him out, man. And also, guys, I got the ring. If you guys play Unlimited, I got the ring first try. Don't even ask how. It was the most luckiest thing ever. Um, but, yo, Eric Gordon, let's peep his price. I know he was a lot cheaper yesterday. So 2,000 MT. If you have him, if you invested in him yesterday, he was around 15 to 1400. You could have sniped out a lot. His price will <coughs> definitely go up. I'm gonna buy that out. No, nope, never mind. People are probably sitting on this filter. If you think about it, if you constantly snipe him for 2,000, let's say you snipe five every minute, you're gonna make about 300 to 400 MT per snipe after reduction. So if you get a couple under 2,000 MT. And you get five per minute. That's around, well, let's say you get so 400 MT. You're going to make over, what, 1,500 MT per minute? You do the math, man. That's a lot of MT. That's a lot of MT. So it's up to you. The Ruby filter in general is pretty solid. You just got to know what you're doing. Auction house glitch does kind of ruin this. Hopefully they fix it soon. But if I were you, you want to make some quick MT, try to put Ruby to 1,800 refresh. When everything pops up, you're going to make a lot of MT. It's a very easy, easy method. Um, Next up, man, going over badges. Some badges actually did rise because there is new cars in packs. Um, if you have clamps, range extenders sitting in your collection, try to sell them. Because if you sell them, you're going to make lots of MT. I'm trying to get my MT back up. I don't have that much MT to work with. But right now, man, I'm trying to sell badges, trying to sell some shoes, scrapping up MT, making little snipes here and there. That's pretty much the best way to make MT right now. You just got to scrap, scrap, scrap. If you want to make big bucks, you got to go for the hard, hard snipes, Giannis, Dominique, um pretty much other pink diamonds and whatnot it's just very hard to snipe um pink diamond snipe filter was somewhat dry yesterday i did miss a lot of snipes on it but in my opinion guys the duran uh the yana snipe filter by far is one of the best snipe filters right now um i don't know why it is but i only got one but i missed 10 if i got all those 10s yesterday was going for around 200,000 mt if i sold over 200 kmt and i picked up all those 10s i'm making 80,000 8,000 80 oh no, no, no. 80,000 times 10 is 800k. And I had enough MT to get all those cars for 100k. I had about 600, 700k. So I would have only got seven. I would have made around what? 60, 600k MT if I got all those. So whoever got those Giannis's, man, I know somebody had a lot of MT trying to snipe those out. Whoever got them, they're G's because they made so much bank. And whoever got them, if you got Giannis's, let me know down below. Pretty much overall, should you say your cards right now? Like I said, it's up to you. If you have Dominique, you don't plan on doing the idle set, now's a really good time to sell him. I doubt he'll go up in value. I think his value's peaked. One person, guys, that I still think is going to go up in value is Mon Ginobili. A couple sold yesterday for around 150, 170K on Xbox. Trust me, guys, <clears throat> this Mon Ginobili is no joke. He is a goat. There's not even a lot on the auction. If you get your hands on a Mon Ginobili, you're going to make MT guaranteed. But yo, other than that, man, that's really all we got for the video. I just want to go over the auction quick for you guys. Pretty much overall, don't pop these packs. Stay sniping. Let me know. There's also one more filter I want to show you before we do end this. And it's uh, pretty much just Amethyst filter, man. Try to out some Amis for around 6,700. Just keep refreshing. That's all we got for the vid. Hope this helps you out. Let me know if you make MT down below. Have a good one. Peace. What's up, guys? If you want cheap, fast, reliable MT, make sure to hit me up on Instagram and Twitter. Links down below for the cheapest fastest reliable mt on the internet right now